What is IMS in Android? If you've ever wondered what that IMS service is on your Android device, you're not alone. Let's break it down to understand its role and importance. IMS, or IP Multimedia Subsystem, is a framework that enables multimedia services over IP networks. On Android, it's crucial for providing advanced communication services like vault -E, Voice over LTE, Wi-Fi calling, and RCS, Rich Communication Services. To implement IMS on Android, developers use the ImService API, introduced in Android 9. This API acts as a well-defined interface between the Android platform and the IMS implementation provided by vendors or carriers. It allows the IMS implementer to provide important signaling information, such as IMS registration, SMS over IMS integration, and MMTEL feature integration for voice and video calling. When an app implements the IMS service, it must register itself with the Android platform. This involves adding a service entry in the Android manifest.xml file, specifying attributes like direct boot aware and persistent to ensure the service runs correctly even before the user unlocks the device and persists without being killed by the system. The app also needs to define which IMS features it supports, such as MMTEL or RCS. The IMS service supports various communication services, including VoIP, Presence, Push-to-Talk, and Conference Calls. These services are standardized and follow specific rules and procedures defined by 3GPP specifications. For example, the OME Simple Instant Messaging service only permits SIP sessions to include messaging components and does not allow upgrading a messaging session to a voice session. On your Android device, the IMS service operates within the core network, ensuring smooth communication. It provides enhanced call quality through vault -E and advanced messaging features through RCS. Users can make calls over Wi-Fi connections, which is particularly useful in areas with weak cellular reception. To manage IMS services, apps can use the IMS Manager class to get instances of IMS MTEL Manager or IMS RCS Manager. These managers help apps listen to or modify the state of the IMS service, including updates on IMS registration and provisioning status. If you encounter issues with your IMS service, such as problems with network connectivity or voice calls, you can temporarily halt the service by going to the Settings menu, navigating to Apps, finding the IMS service, and tapping for Stop. However, disabling the IMS service permanently may impact carrier-specific features like vault -E and Wi-Fi calling, so it's best to consult your carrier before doing so. In summary, the IMS service on Android is essential for modern telecommunications, offering a robust framework for multimedia and voice communication services. Understanding how it works can help you appreciate the advanced features it brings to your device.